what is a person, right? Because it's not just what you achieve or what you uh, acquire or accomplish or or even uh, just the stuff of what we are, yeah, our physical bodies. Uh, but what, so what would you say? What is a person? Yeah, you, you ask great questions. I said this okay. to you in uh, advance. But, <laughs> but I love these questions that you're oh, asking. Good, about, good. So, uh, I mean, there are many definitions of person out there, mm -hmm. but uh, core to many within what's called the personalist tradition would, that, would be that uh, each human Mm -hmm. uh, individual has uh, a sense of inviolability or mm -hmm. that people can't be violated. Uh, there's a sense in which mm -hmm. we're unfathomable mysteries. Mm -hmm. uh, and this is my own language, but I'm getting at core themes that I think appear in various traditions and that uh, we're unrepeatable. So mm -hmm. uh, there's a sense of un inviolable even when people sin against us and we sin against others yeah. we can't take away from people's personhood no matter how we try because it's not something we own it's inherent yeah. based on our being created in the image of god now that's a judeo-christian vantage yeah. point there that i'm drawing from uh there are people who don't hold to the christian tradition that would still affirm certain aspects that i, I just outlined so inviolability Mm. Uh, that we cannot be violated even when sinned against or sinning against others because of our identity and worth comes from being created in the image of God. Mm -hmm. um, we're unfathomable. We're, we're mysteries. And uh, we need to treat one another as mysteries. And C.S. Lewis mm -hmm. gets at this in weight of glory. You've never met a mere mortal. Mm -hmm. um, uh, either an infinite horror to be repulsed by or someone would be tempted to be worshiping. And, uh, you know, we're made for glory in, in the image yeah. of God and in relationship to God and one another. Um, and then, as I said, that we're unrepeatable, you know, that old children's, I don't know if it's a Sunday school lesson or what, they were all like snowflakes, mm -hmm. you know, there's mm -hmm. a sense oh, yeah, yeah. really true and profound. It might be simple, mm -hmm. but it gets at this, this deep concept yeah. of personalism. And then um, with that, we each have individuality, but not yeah. individuality apart from one, one another, but only in relation to one another. Yeah. And it doesn't count. It does from a Christian vantage point account for our embodiment. So it's yeah. not simply spirit we're embodied spirits uh yeah. or um spirited bodies however we want to frame it yeah, but it, it yeah. involves our embodiment it's not reduced to our embodiment but it includes and is bound up with that and our individual agency that's all part of yeah. what would be included within the personalist trajectory 